Hello, it's Miss Carpenter and I am here today to show you how to get a Google slide as an image and upload it into ThingLink on an iPad. I understand that some of you have been having problems and after a lot of troubleshooting, I realized that there was a very easy way. So what I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm going to open up my drive. Oops, I shouldn't hold it down. Just tap my drive right there. Tap it. And you're going to need to know what your book, been, your slide that you want an image of is called. In my case, it is my book bento example because that's the item that I have a student having trouble with. So you need to be able to find it in your drive. Go ahead and select it. And then what you're going to do is you're going to go ahead and take a screenshot. And the way that you do that is by holding down the power button on the top right of your iPad and the home button, which is that button on the bottom middle of your iPad. The home button on the bottom middle is a circle and the power button is kind of like a silver bar on the top right. So I'm going to press those both at the same time. You can see if you've successfully taken a screenshot, it's going to pop up right there in the bottom. Uh-oh, it went away. So I'm going to do it again. I talked too long. So I'm going to take a screenshot and I'm going to tap it. Now here I am like this. These um, bars on the corners, you can see that I'm cropping my image. And it'll continue to get bigger as you crop it. Just get right all there nice on the sides. A little bit on this side. Okay, there we go. It's cropped. I'm going to hit done on the top left. And it's going to give me three options to delete, save to files, or save to photos. I'm going to choose save to photos. And it's saved. I'm going to press my home button and I'm back in my home screen. So now I need to get into ThingLink. I'm gonna open up Google Chrome, and I am going to type in ThingLink. And go. Um, you should have already logged in with Google Remember, I have shared those class codes on your Schoology course page, but you will need to be logged in with your account and see your picture. That way you know you are in fact logged in. I'm going to hit create, upload an image, and I'm going to select my photo library. You can see there that I have all photos. I'm going to select that. Select the cropped image I created and hit done. Now I have my Google slide as an image in ThingLink and I will begin to be able to create tags. And there you go, just like that. When you're finished, you go ahead and hit done, and then you put the link in as an assignment in Schoology. I hope this helps.